What's going on ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another mod showcase. Today we're going to be taking a look at Stormwatch Castle by Skyrim Laz. Now it's been a while since I've done these. Um, and this was actually, uh, this, well not this particular home, but uh, someone requested on my channel uh, that, I, that, that, that I do a smaller home. Uh, by Skyrim Laz, one of his latest, and this is one of his latest. I think this is his most recent one. Um, but yeah, so uh, it's a much smaller home than what you know Skyrim Laz usually puts out. But you know, I've never, I haven't actually been inside. Um, now the home does cost thirty-five k, somewhere around that number. Um, so I'll show you where it is on the map real quick. So. Stormwatch is right here. Uh, Tundra Homestead, which I already did a showcase on. I'll leave a link to that video in the description below. Uh, White Run is over here with the Ritual Stone and Valtheim Towers over there. So, yeah. So, um, now pull the chain and immediately when you first walk in, you're greeted by beautiful garden, beautiful. <laughs> well, uh, I wouldn't call it a garden, but it's it is uh, what it is. You have a apiary. What's in here? You have ooh, you have a little uh, little hangout spot, a little garden spot. How much casual quarks? Okay. We'll go in there in a minute. So let us. So I think that's it from outside. Let's go inside. Nice little hallway. Wait, what? What? Hello? Um... Okay. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> so apparently I went uh, too far. Alright, now let's uh, go from left to right, shall we? So you have a little bar area. You have, uh, uh, we'll go downstairs in a minute. <laughs> Little, um, I'm assuming a follower's room. Okay, so there's multiple doors in here. Okay, so that leads out to Skyrim. And I'm assuming, yet yeah, this is your bedroom. You have a little uh, study area and a teleport spell if you if you wanted to teleport back here. Wardrobes, obviously it's empty. Empty and empty. Let's check out here. What's out here? A nice little balcony area. The thing on inside. I don't know why it uh, says this requires key, but oh well. I think what I'm noticing a theme is um, every time you go outside, the door locks. I don't know if I like that. Maybe it's because I have a mod. I don't know. I really don't know. Have a little neat little uh neat little um drinking area whatever whatever have you let's go downstairs real quick now let's see what's downstairs 
Ooh. Okay, so a neat little pool. Pool area with some, with some soaps and towels. Obviously, I think it's static, but. So this is Hearthfire uh, multiple adoptions friendly. So you, if you have that mod, you could have multiple uh, kids in here. So you have your books, every empty chest, more. All right. But yeah, so this is adoption friendly in case you wanted to have um, in case you wanted to have uh, adopt kids and stuff like that. So library armory so let's go back up oh, wow so you have door so i have more follower beds you have your garden area your alchemy and enchanting area. And you have your safes. That's a bit of cool. Where's this going? Okay, that leads to Skyrim. And you have your smithy. You have um, chest for storage. You have your... Um, smelter, you have your forge, um, wood chopping block. No, um, I think that's bugged, but you have, I guess, your metery place. Better, better cool. downstairs because there's more stuff downstairs uh let's go to the library first now this is neat display case huh you have all sorts of books. You have the Book of the Dragonborn. You have Boethius Proving, Ogba Infinium, Dreamstride, Mythic Dawn. You have the Black Books all over here. You have the Elder Scrolls, Sun, Dragon, and Blood. You have the Betrayed, all the unique books. And then you have display kit. Okay, so I think something's conflicting with it. As you can see, something is definitely conflicting. Or maybe it's just design that I don't know. Let's see. What's in here? Armory. Okay, so that leads to the armory. We'll go there in a minute. And then you have more beds. You have your study area, bookworms, for, uh, bu bookworms for books. My God, I am so rusty with this, but it is what it is. You have your display cases. You have, um, you have, um, all the weapon racks, 
that you could possibly want. Mannequins. Oh, more weapon racks. More weapon racks and plaques. So you have no shortage of... of mannequins and armor blacks and weapon racks and stuff like that. So that's very cool. All right, so I need to go up here. Not what I wanted to do. All right. Uh, at least a skyrim. <clears throat> All right. So I'm assuming this is the dining area and the kitchen area. Yep. Definitely the kitchen area. I love it. I think it's unique. Would I use it? Not really. Um, well, maybe. Who knows? Yeah. Who knows? Maybe I will use it. Maybe I won't. But, um, yeah. Anyways, I think that's it. Unless I miss something. Let me just double check real quick. Yeah, I don't think I missed anything. I think this is one, like I said, this is one of Skyrim Laz's um, smaller homes. So, anyways, I hope you all enjoyed that little showcase. I'm trying to get back into the swing of things of sh doing showcases and stuff while also on top of do doing Let's Plays. Uh, yeah, so I will see you all in the next one. Make sure to like, subscribe, and comment on the video. Let me know what you thought. Would you use it? Would, would would you use it? Would you not use it? Would you love it? Would Do you love it? Do you hate it? Let me know. And I will see you all next time. Bye, guys.